Hello friends, in this video we'll see how you can detail the longitudinal reinforcement of the columns, okay? Numbers here represent the sectional area of the required reinforcement values. For example, in this column, the area of 1494 mm square is required. Same is for these two values as well. Okay, so you can see that the higher value is at the upper floors than the lower floor, right? So uh, while detailing, you have to make sure that while going from down to the top, the reinforcement area value must decrease and it must not increase, okay? So how we can tackle this problem, we'll see later in this video. For now, we'll just uh, detail this column as an example and we'll also detail these other columns also. Okay, so uh, for this purpose, we'll be using the Excel for our easiness. Okay, so let's open the Excel. Okay, so let's make a rough sheet. So we'll do bar. So we'll do numbers, number of bars, that the area, uh, total area, total area. So this is just a rough thing, okay? So you can um, design your Excel sheet as per your requirement. And let's do is that the final area. Okay, so the bar uh, means the bar. So suppose we are using 16 mm bar. So it's the uh, bar numbers. Uh, suppose if we are using four numbers of bar. So area means the area of one bar. So area of one bar is equal to pi by four into the bar size square, right? So 3.1416 divided by four into uh, this again into this value, right? And hit enter. Uh, total area means the total area of the provider reinforcement so that is number of bars into the area of one bar right so we do it as is equal to this into this right so the final area is the area that we obtain after adding all the bars okay so after that we just uh, copy this row just copy it and we just paste it okay so now that we have got the required area as 1494 mm square so what you have to do uh, you have to attain that value okay so uh, let's add these two values so this plus this so uh, these two make 1608 which is higher than that is required so let's do with 12 mm bars if it works a 12 mm bar if you provide four in numbers the area give us as one two five six but the required area here is one four nine four right so what do we do we again convert it into 16 so 16 number of bars, 80 numbers, right? So it's 1608, which is uh, higher than this value. So we are okay with it. Okay. 